What is going on guys? This is Trio One and we are back with another video. It is now September and that means the iPhone 12 launch date is around the corner. The biggest news we have heard this week is the confirmed Apple event. Apple is holding a digital only full event on Tuesday, September the 15th. Apple has a history of announcing their iPhones in the month of September. We are more than likely looking at four different variants. Now, every year there is an update to the iPhone and every year people are surprised that there is an update to the iPhone. Typically, there is one major update to the iPhone every single year. Apple normally gets up on the stage at an event that would normally take place in September. So, two iPhone 12s alongside two iPhone 12 Pros. And if that sounds confusing, to break down what that lineup could look like, we would start out with a 5.4 inch iPhone 12, then jump up to a 6.1 inch iPhone 12 Max. We would then move to the Pro lineup with a 6.1 inch iPhone 12 Pro, and then finally a bigger 6.7 inch iPhone 12 Pro Max. There's a couple of really exciting things here. One is the idea of a small 5.0 inch iPhone which is great news for someone who wanted something more compact and the size of an iPhone 11 but wanted something more than the iPhone SE. The other exciting thing is a rumor of regardless of screen size or pro versus non pro is OLED across the entire lineup. That was a huge difference between the iPhone 11 and 11 pro LCD versus the OLED. So the potential to get that across the entire lineup is exciting. Something else I would love to see this year is Apple continuing that trend of bringing that price down. So if we could go from 749 to 699 down to 649 especially with that smaller 5.4 inch iPhone 12 that would be stellar. Just like last year both the iPhone 12 and 12 Pro models are expected to share the same processor which should be the A14. That's exciting to me for a couple of reasons. One I kind of feel like Apple was holding back a little bit last year whereas the A14 should be a monster in terms of performance. Here is this AR thing that everyone's going to analyze and look way too much into it and ultimately it just left everybody questioning everything. The blue Apple logo is clearly hinting towards a blue iPhone 12. Apple has a history of announcing their iPhones in the month of September. The entire lineup is also rumored to pack 5G. People are also pointing out that 2 hours for just the watch and the iPad doesn't really make that much sense. The cool AR implementation which is a tease for the LiDAR sensor that we are going to see on the iPhone 12 models. It's going to take the AR games to the next level. Also the fact that the Apple logo is in the blue color means that it kind of confirms the navy blue color that we are going to see on the iPhone 12 models. The Apple logo is also drawn by a pencil which highlights the that the new iPad is coming and the way it's twisting around that may be a tease for the new watch series 6. There's also a teasing tagline that says time flies. A lot of people are saying that this is highlighting the time of flight sensor aka the lidar sensor that we'll be seeing in the iPhone 12 models. Again, nothing is confirmed. Apple might put a surprise on everyone. There's always that uncertainty which is super exciting. Anything can happen on September 15th. The way this year has gone, anything could happen. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like and subscribe to our channel.